So as I explained in previous video, uh, value of the US dollar or US dollar exchange rate versus uh, foreign currencies is one of the factors that affects the crude oil price. Uh, as we know, crude oil uh, is, an, is a global commodity that is traded globally uh, uh, but in US dollars. So any fluctuations in the exchange rate uh, between US dollar and foreign currencies can affect uh, the crude oil uh, price. I'm going to explain that in a, a very simple example. Let's assume there are two traders uh, who trade crude oil, uh, crude oil uh, futures contracts. So one is uh, trader A is in the United States and trader B is in Europe. Trader A has one thousand dollars and trader B has one thousand euros. So first, let's assume that the exchange rate between uh, uh, U.S. dollar and euro is one to one. So meaning that one dollar is equivalent to one euro and let's assume uh, that crude oil uh, price is fifty dollars per barrel okay let's see what happens uh, uh, for uh, trader a trader a has one thousand dollars and can buy 20 barrels of crude oil or can buy futures a uh, contract equivalent to 20 uh, barrels of crude oil so a thousand dollars divided by 50 uh, leaves uh, 20 barrels of crude oil. Let's see what happens to the trader in euro. Tra so trader B has 1000 euros. The first thing that trader B has to do is uh, going to the exchange and uh, convert the 1000 euros to uh, the equivalent dollar amount which is $1000. Then with that amount trader B can buy crude oil. Uh, so trader B can also buy 20 uh, barrels of uh, crude oil. So the total uh, demand will be 20 from inside the United States and 20 internationally uh, assuming there are only two traders so there will be 40 barrels of crude oil demand, total demand. Okay now let's assume the case that US dollar loses its value. So again, same traders, two traders, uh, trader A is located in the United States and has a thousand dollars, trader B is in Europe and has a thousand euros. And now uh, let's assume US dollar uh, has lost its value. Uh, now one dollar is equivalent to 0.8 euros. Or with one euro, uh, you can get one dollars and 25 cents and let's assume the crude oil price is still the same 50 dollars per barrel and let's see what happens okay trader a still has a thousand dollars crude oil price is still 50 dollars per barrel so trader a inside the united states can still get that 20 barrels of crude oil and let's see what happens to trader B. Trader B has a thousand euros. Trader B has to go and exchange that a thousand euros to equivalent uh, uh, dollar. And as we can see, because dollar has lost its value, that a thousand euros will be converted to a thousand two hundred fifty dollars. Because with one euro. Uh, trader B will get one dollar and twenty-five cents. So Trader B has a thousand two hundred fifty dollars, which uh, can buy five more contracts. So Trader B will end up buying twenty-five uh, barrels of crude oil or futures contract equivalent to uh, twenty-five barrels of crude oil. So twenty barrels demand from trader A uh, inside the United States and 25 barrels of crude oil uh, demand from uh, trader B outside the United States. So total demand will be 20 plus 25, 45 barrels. So we can see the demand increase from 40 barrels to 45 barrels uh, when the dollar has lost its value. So it means that demand 
has increased so demand curve shifted to the left hand side which changes the market equilibrium price for crude oil and it potentially increases the uh, crude oil price.